Well, the public got a first look at the reconstructed Memphis Tigers roster ahead of the start of basketball season. Aaron Wilson tells us how the team is shaping up. Well, I can tell you this. After watching the practice here for the University of Memphis men's basketball team, there's obviously some new faces on the roster and coaching staff. But one thing is not new at all. That's the end goal of making it back to March Madness as they did last season. And, of course, with no postseason ban heading into this season, it's very possible. I thank God for, the, you know, all of that being behind us. I trust in it from day one. Now I wouldn't be here. Tuesday, the IRAP decided to remove the dark cloud hanging over the Tigers program by ruling against a postseason ban and instead decided on a fine and probation. With the team feeling what they call a relief, many of the players are focused on building on the success of last season. Just to be a part of that with Coach Penny, uh, to be a part of anything with Coach Penny in the city, it's a blessing by itself. So just to be uh, along this journey uh, through the roller coaster with everything, um, it, it's a blessing. And after celebrating Senior Day last season, it was for that reason that Alex Lomax decided to return, along with familiar faces like Malcolm Dandridge, the Lawsons, and DeAndre Williams. Despite most of the team being first-year Tigers, Williams said experience is not a problem for Memphis headed into this season. There's no pressure. We got a lot of guys that's experienced, fifth-year guys, so it's a smaller learning curve. Which might make for a smoother transition with multiple new faces on the coaching staff as well. We got a lot of knowledge on the sideline. Including the return of Larry Brown and introduction of former Whitehaven and Mitchell High head coach Faraji Phillips as an assistant coach and Frank Haith who's no stranger to coaching in the postseason. With the team in place that forward DeAndre Williams says has no egos, head coach Penny Hardaway said he's ready to get the season started. We ended great so we want to begin great. I know the, uh, the history of Tiger basketball doesn't really get going until like January, February. This year, we're locked in and loaded on, on getting getting ready in November. Tiger basketball opens preseason hosting Christian Brothers University Sunday, October 23rd, 4 p.m. Central. In Memphis, I'm Aaron Wilson.